So thank you, South Carolina. God bless you. It's a great night in South Carolina. The last time a governor was elected in South Carolina, there were no running mates. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a pleasure for me to introduce to you the next Lieutenant Governor of South Carolina, Pamela Evett. But now the Governor and Lieutenant Governor are part of the same ticket after voters in 2012 agreed to the change in a referendum. But now... I feel a, a storm cloud brewing. Senator Harvey Peeler says the General I, Assembly still hasn't worked out the details of the law uh, with a June primary the just around the corner. So he's filed a bill to delay the primaries by a month unless the House agrees to drop an amendment that Peeler claims is unrelated to the issue. One of the senators says that Senator Peeler had filed that to embarrass the House. Uh, so, you know, you can take it for what it's, what it's worth at that point. Lawmakers say there is little chance the June primaries will actually be delayed, but say the law passed by voters in 2012 should have been addressed by now. This constitutional amendment passed in 2012, and so we've had six years to get it done, and, and we're going to get it done. If not, the next round of elections could be held in the odd month of July.